Welcome to That's The Point, your inside scoop on the latest construction technology and workflows, brought to you by the experts at Building Point. All right, hey everybody. Uh, welcome back to That's The Point. It is great to be here again. Uh, my name is Steve Karen, joined by my co-host, Mr. Jonathan Stickle. How are you, buddy? I'm doing good. Great to be here. Good, good. Um, so yeah, we wanted to jump into this one because over the past you know few days we've spent I'd say a lot of time with the XR10. So what you know so far, what are your thoughts? What are you thinking? It, it's a very cool solution. I think um, I'm learning something new every single time I put it on. There's yeah, just, for sure. There's just so much to learn. It, it's you know completely foreign. Um, but yeah, it's very cool. I, I feel like I've been noticing you and other people around the office though laughing at me as you're walking by my office and I'm just kind of pointing into thin air. <laughs> so I've been noticing it. Yeah, for sure. I mean, you look like a crazy person. Um, but but we all do. I mean, you know, we all do. Little things that I've seen, I, I think um, the advancements that they've made with, you know, kind of registering your hand, picking up your hand movement and stuff, I think that's really cool. Um, you know, big improvement from from the Gen 1. Mm -hmm. um, you know, again, being able to, to register all, all of your digits rather than kind of that click that we're used to. Um, I would say that I'm definitely still getting used to, you know, moving holograms around, things like that, and just forget about scrolling. I, I haven't figured that that out yet it's kind of moving a little but i don't know what i'm doing yeah i wouldn't worry about it too much i think um i think the more we use it the more we'll get more comfortable and it'll start to feel more natural um, at least for me i feel that i'm starting to pick up um some some new things as uh, each day goes by jumping into this again just you know want to help you on the setup side of everything charge the xr10 and charge your mobilist headset as soon as you take it out of the box um, we just want you to have a full battery once once you've set everything up and you're ready to go. And and also, I really think that the XR10 is is not something that you're going to be wearing all day. Yeah. At any time. No, you know, I, you're not going to be agree. in the office or out in the field with this thing strapped to your head for eight hours. You know, looking at stuff. It's it's not going to happen. So I don't think you're ever really going to have that kind of you know battery you know drain like that. So it's it's really not going to be that big of a deal. But mm -hmm. but again, just when you're starting off your day and you're, you know, starting off with your, you know, first time use, just go ahead and, and, and charge it all the way up. You know, next we're going to quickly discuss your account logins and, and you're going to want to get those things set up ahead of time. So if you want to kick us off with the, the Microsoft side of it. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, the HoloLens, it does have a web browser. You are able to set up log information um, on there, but we've just found that it's much easier to go ahead and do that on the computer rather than, you know, trying to point and tap uh, your login information and things like that. Right. Yeah. Um, like we've, we've used mobile devices. We all have smartphones and tablets, but there are certain things that are just easier to do on a computer. And, and this is one of them. So just sure. go ahead and uh, uh, save some time doing that. That being said, the HoloLens 2 is a Microsoft product. So you need a Microsoft account in order to, in order to use it. Um, when you're setting it up, like when you're first putting it on your head, it'll ask you, are you setting it up? Like, do you own this device or are you using this for work and school? So are you a single user or are you a multi-user? Um, if you are using it for work, you're going to want to check in with your IT department just to see how they would like you to proceed and how they want you to log in. Right, yeah. Some companies might do things a little bit different, so just go ahead and check with your, your own IT department and let them, you know, give you the right route that they want to take. Exactly. Um, if you need... Um, if you need to sign up for a Microsoft account, you can go to account.microsoft.com and go ahead and click on this create a Microsoft account and go ahead and set up your account that way. Um, if you're someone that's not sure if you have a Microsoft account, if you're using Outlook, OneDrive, um, Skype, Office 365, some of those applications, a lot of that stuff, <laughs> um, you, you have a Microsoft account and you can you can use that as well. Um, so then that leads me to the Trimble Connect for Hololens side. Mm -hmm. um, so the Trimble piece of it. Now, as Building Point representatives, you know, we are using Trimble Connect uh, to get our data into the device. Um, you know, the HoloLens does have, you know, it has a Microsoft UI. You can download applications, you know, anything you'd like into there. But for us, we are using Trimble Connect for HoloLens. Um, so if you do not have a Trimble Connect account already, what you do is go ahead and visit connect.trimble.com. So that, that will go ahead and, and, and bring up a page that... Um, it's going to allow you to kind of see some of the different um, connect options that are in there. Um, and then you'll also see that there's a, a free trial in there as well. But um, for the different options, I wanted to hop in and just speak to you real quickly because you're going to see a few different areas. There's 
business, business premium, you know, business has a collaboration piece to it. Business premium has collaboration. It's got then kind of another suite of applications and workflow extensions that add on to that. But what we really want to talk about, the main thing that, you know, I even brought it up is because for the XR10 and and the HoloLens 2, you want to look at Trimble Connect for mixed reality. Correct. Um, So what that's going to do is give you the functionality of business premium plus the XR10 and HoloLens premium workflows that come with it. So 3D design res- review, coordination, collaboration, um, sequencing. Um, it's also got uh, some project management in there, so you can some you know create some to-dos for RFI management. So that's where you want to be when you're actually talking about the XR10 um, is, is with the uh, mixed reality component of, of Trimble Connect. We did see the trial license in there. Mm-hmm. Um, so Trimble does give you a 30-day free trial so that you can go ahead and get in there and check everything out. For newly purchased license, so if you just purchase your first Trimble Connect license, or even if you already own Trimble Connect, just go ahead and, and reach out to your local building point representative, and then they'll help you nav- navigate getting that set up with, um, with the XR10. And then uh, lastly, I just want to hit everyone with our big you know, building point tip of the week. Um, pro, tip. pro tip. Big, nice. yeah, <laughs> big time. Um, and that is, is to go ahead and go to your mobile device and download the Trimble Connect application. You can log into the XR10 app using a QR code. So you go to the Connect Mobile application on your phone, uh, just go to the menu, and then you'll see HoloLens Companion. Um, And then go ahead and hit that. It'll give you a QR code. And then what you'll do is just bring up the XR10 Connect app, and then you'll see a QR code button. Hit that thing, scan it, and you're in. So quick and easy, no typing in anything, you're in. Yeah, exactly. And we understand that um, the video about login information, it's not the most exciting content or information sure, yeah, that you're going to see that. today. We're just helping to provide a little tips to make the uh, setup process just a little smoother for you. Mm-hmm. Did want to let you know that we are uh, shooting a new video here in the next uh, two days or so. So uh, keep an eye out for that. We'll be getting on the XR10. Yeah, so you'll... It's about time. Yeah, it's about time. <laughs> Finally, it's here. Um, so yeah, keep an eye out for that. But uh, that's really all we have for you today. Um, If you have any questions or thoughts, please let us know in the comments below. Also, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. That'll ensure that you never miss a beat or a new episode once it goes live. And if you want to learn more, please reach out to your local Building Point representative today. We're here to help you out. On behalf of Steve, myself, and the entire Building Point team, thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time on That's The Point. Thanks again for joining us on That's The Point. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe on YouTube today.